On November 8, 2013, Super Typhoon Yolanda, the strongest storm to ever hit land in history, battered central Philippines, especially the provinces of Leyte, Samar, Cebu, and Iloilo. Human death toll was at 6,300, according to the USAID, with another 4.1 million displaced and 1.1 million houses destroyed. Where to house disaster victims like those of Yolanda poses one big logistical challenge. Usually, they end up in crowded schools, gymnasiums, churches, public buildings, or anywhere that will make them feel safe, but still endure inhospitable conditions such as being exposed to communicable diseases and missing the privacy provided by a normal family shelter. The Philippine Development Plan of 2011 to 2016 estimates the country's housing needs to reach 5.8 million units by 2016. Current housing backlog is approximately 980,000 units. This need becomes more challenging with the soaring cost of building shelters and the logging moratorium on the country's natural and residual forests. Recognizing the plight of calamity victims, research engineers of the Department of Science and Technology's Forest Products Research and Development Institute, or DOSTFPRDI, developed a shelter called the Do-It-Yourself Bamboo Shelter, suited to Philippine condition. The Do-It-Yourself, or DIY Bamboo Shelter, is a low-cost, semi-permanent shelter intended to make housing more accessible to the public, particularly the poor. Bamboo is a promising substitute for timber due to its renewability and widespread availability. Cheaper than wood, it has strength properties comparable to mild steel, making it fit for structural applications. Let's take a look at the key features of this bamboo house. The DIY bamboo shelter is made from erect bamboo poles. For this prototype house, the bamboo species used was bolo, but other bamboo species such as kawaiian tinik and botong may be used, provided they are straight and approximately 4 inches in diameter. The bamboo poles used were also treated with environment-friendly preservatives. The DIY bamboo shelter can be erected using modular construction method which makes it easy to assemble as a house. It uses a simple bolt and nut jointing system. This shelter measures 24 square meters and consists of a living room, kitchen, bedroom, toilet and bath, and sink. It is also ready for tapping to electric and water utilities. The walls and roofing are also made from bamboo poles, while the truss, posts, and window and door jams are made of coconut lumber, which are available in most parts of the country. The upper portion of the shelter can be anchored to the ground to support the unit against strong winds. Assembling the DIY bamboo shelter is as easy as one, two, three.
Why use the DIY bamboo shelter? It can be acquired instantly. Houses using conventional and emerging technologies usually take three to four months from planning to construction. Buying a DIY bamboo house, therefore, is like buying time. It is also transportable and can be dismantled, stored, and used repeatedly. When packed, the bamboo shelter can fit in a six-wheeler truck. Envisioned as a ready-to-assemble house, it is intended to be erected within three to four days, following the instruction manual. It can be assembled by as few as four medium-built workers using simple carpenter's tools. No need for heavy equipment. The DIY bamboo shelter is environment-friendly and rust-proof. Bamboo is also a natural heat insulator. Hence, it is cool and comfortable inside the unit. How much does it cost? The cost of a 24 square meter structure ranges from 75,000 to 150,000 pesos or 3,125 to 6,250 pesos per square meter. This is within the price of houses built by groups such as Gawad Kalinga and Habitat for Humanity and lower than government low-cost houses that are pegged at 6,000 to 7,500 pesos per square meter. The bamboo shelter also comes in several variants with corresponding costs. It can be used as an emergency shelter, workers' quarters, depot for food and emergency supplies during relief operations, emergency classroom, mobile clinic for medical missions, field office for construction projects, or as a mobile vacation house. Easy to assemble, durable, cost-effective, environment-friendly, comfortable, versatile. The do-it-yourself bamboo shelter is an innovation made for such a time as this, a time when the disastrous consequences of climate change are affecting the lives of more and more Filipinos. As the country hurdles environmental issues such as climate change and natural disasters and economic problems like the increasing cost of building shelters and limited supply of raw materials, bamboo can be the answer to such challenges.